deep. She has that kind of look in her eye all the time. Yes, yeah, so it'll be interesting to see how the pitcher will pitch her, how much respect they will give her. And right there, Alex Hugo squares around a bun as Wilson takes off for second base. That looked like a play put on by Coach Lou Harris Champer. Hugo is never intending to bunt, just trying to get in the way of the catcher. Right, an effective strategy. Another still in color by Hugo. You saw Wilson do it to move the runners, and now they have both runners in scoring position. Hugo with 12 RBIs on the air, 7 of 14, 3 homers. And then 1 0 is called strike right around the knees, evening up the count at 1. 64 miles an hour right there from Allen. And given Hugo's history, if you're Winthrop, pitcher, you want to keep the ball low and away from Hugo as much as possible. She has so much power. Anything you throw in, she's just going to yank it. And she already stands with that open stance, the 1-1, one, one, and she drives this one out to right center field. That one's going to drop. Scoring is Emmanuel. Rounding third, headed home is Paige Wilson, and sliding in safely to second base, and she's pumped up down there. She drives in two runs for the Bulldogs, a two-RBI double for Alex Hugo, and the Dogs lead the Winthrop Eagles 3 to nothing here in the bottom half of the first. And that's why I like watching Hugo. As you see, she keeps her hands in. Go opposite field. That's where you want to go. And then when she slides in the second base, she comes up with a fist pump, showing her excitement for driving in those runs. She really is a team player. I had the chance to talk to her last night and talked about her mentality going up to the plate. And she says she doesn't really think. She just likes to swing the bat and see where the ball goes. Is Kaylee Puailu 